Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy, and I'm going to review the original PBR hard, hard coffee. So, what was this thing called again? This is the Pass Blue Ribbon Hard Coffee Original. So, 5% ABV. <clears throat> this was arranged to have sent to me by Tyler and Janine at Wise Acres Farm. <clears throat> Along with a four pack of uh, some sour, uh, sour ales and, and some duck fat Chex Mix. So this is my last review <clears throat> of their products that they had sent here. Unless I try to figure out um, if I can get like another, like a hard, another hard coffee type product, um, and do a comparison video. I might try that if I can. Um, we'll see. So I've been, I've already had the salted caramel, the mocha, and the hazelnut. They're all, they're all really good. And here's the original. I reviewed this two years ago, so it's been two years ago since I reviewed this, this regular one. I hoped to have this one done before <clears throat> before Christmas now it's kind of past for most people I think um, unless they unless you guys you know have a like a um, um, a New Year's Eve party um, but I think Tyler and Janine were gonna watch these during their Christmas party event but uh, I tried. I tried to get them, but it just I just didn't have didn't have enough time, you know. Okay, well, let's see. Hmm, smells really good. It's got that that milk chocolate aroma. A little bit of that coffee aroma. A little bit of the lactose milky type of aroma. A little bit of a, like a vanilla is kind of going on in there. Okay. Let's give it a try. Just like I remember it. <clears throat> has that milk chocolate. It almost has just a little bit of a dark chocolate thing going on. Um, in there as well, you get a little bit of a, a dry kind of, um, uh, uh, like a coffee aftertaste kind of thing. <clears throat> yeah, milky, has a, like a vanilla on the taste, a little bit of a kind of a mocha thing going on with this one, just like the mocha, you know. It's got that medium body, um, <clears throat> kind of like a, like a, like a milk, you know, like a milky beverage. Um, it's got like a, like a little bit of a coffee bitterness on the back end. It's not like real big or anything, but it's kind of there. Um, but it's a smooth, it's a smooth, um, uh, hard coffee, uh, product. I don't, I might get the beer kind of taste in these just a little bit, but it's not like, 
it's not like real big, you know what I mean? It's just not like huge on the taste. <clears throat> It's really good. I like it. Really good. <clears throat> um, yeah, these are considered a, a malt beverage with natural and artificial flavors and contains milk. So that's why you get that lactose kind of taste in there. <clears throat> okay, well, there's not a whole lot more to say about it. Um, Thank you, Tyler and Janine, for for uh, uh, making these um, uh, making these show up on my door on my doorstep. Um, uh, it's really it was really nice you guys to do that, and along with the other stuff, I enjoyed experiencing the different you know the hard coffee flavors, and that that four pack of the sour ales was a really good sour ale. Um, to get the experience as well. The duck fat Chex Mix, I'm still chewing on that. Um, it's a good, unique flavored type of a, of a Chex Mix um, from a place called Antoinette's Baking Company here in Tulsa. Um, Jeremy reviewed that with me. Very interesting type of a Chex Mix product. Uh, I'd like to still look into, you know, the, the process that goes into it. But, uh, okay. Well, thank you all for watching. I appreciate that. And thanks again to Tyler and Janine. And we will see you. I hope you guys, I hope you all had, uh, everybody had a nice Christmas. If you've already celebrated today. Um, <clears throat> some people celebrate it on different days. So, just never know. But, uh, yeah. All right. Um, thanks again. And I'll see you all on the next one.